Here are the specs the Redmi Note 10 Pro and we get to see the extended RAM 6 plus 2 GB RAM and the Android version here is Android 12 the kernel we get here is just the same and the security patch level here is the latest not the latest one first of May 1 security patch level we get to see and the MIUI version here is SR13 and the Calyx beta version now moving back these are the this is the my device page the UI here is a bit different so yes now moving back this is the settings page a quick view to the home screen and this is the clock style we get to see here in this rom and this is the MIUI 13 control center and the notification shade the notification shade here has been a bit customized and we can change to the original one if we want to but this just looks great now moving forward I'll show you the rom this is the app drawer available now going to the settings we get to see the MIUI SR customizations so first of all taking a look at it we get to see the switch control if we turn it off we will get to see the MIUI 12.5 control center as you can see this is how it looks so the modern engine for the MIUI 13 control center is available and as you can see this is how the control center looks if you turn this on the smart hub status bar styles here are available 12 control center modes everything here is available so yeah and in call ui modes here is also available we can set the call brightness the background color and everything now moving back these are all just the same miui options available the wallpaper and personalization always on and lock screen option nothing here is new then going to the display options these are the options and in the refresh rate this is the new ui we get to see we can set the default one the default will be 120 hertz and the custom we can switch to 60 90 and 120 so yeah i'll just prefer the default one it just feels great now moving back the sound and vibration here is same notification and control center going to the home screen these are a lot of options available the animation rate choice the animation in this room here are a bit slow as you can see the app opening app opening animation and the closing animation Animation are smooth enough, but they are a bit slow. They feel slow compared to the stock MIUI. I have set to the full animation, but still the animation here rate is very slow. The minus one screen, we get to see the Google Discover app with app drawer option. The double tap to lock the screen here is available. Then these are the other options. There are a lot of customizations. The double tap to turn off the screen, the swipe up and everything. This double tap to turn off screen here is not working and the swipe up and everything these are the other gestures available now moving back these are the options the password and security face unlock fingerprint scanner everything here is working perfectly fine you know issues as you can see the fingerprint is working face unlock here is working fine then in these special features these are the options the sidebar floating windows second space and everything so yeah these were the only options the setting options now moving to the home screen this is the just the same ui the clock style here is a bit different compared to the other rooms then talking about the camera we get to see the MIUI cam available and all the all the G cams here are working perfectly fine no issues the room here is pretty smooth no issues talking about the scores the Geekbench scores are just not that great here are the scores 477 and 1442 so the scores compared to the other rooms are not that great and overall performance also here is not that great because i feel the animation here is a bit slow and phone just lags a lot as you can see the lag in the app drawer also so yes the room needs a lot more optimizations our room is lagging and also the gaming performance here is not that good otherwise everything here is just the same as the other miui custom roms so yes and the safety net status banking apps everything here is working perfectly fine these were the only new things available in the miui other than the eu rom and talking about the bugs there are bugs present here like the first bug here is with the widgets widgets new widgets here are available but you 
I am not able to add them as you can see when you just drag and drop here it just sticks and now when you go home they just go away so you I am not able to add the widgets on the home screen so this is also a bug present here and the another bug here is with the whatsapp like the other applications they are not able to access the contacts when I open the whatsapp you will see the contact details not the name not the person name so yes that is it for now if you enjoyed this video then don't forget to hit the like button if you are new to this channel then please guys subscribe to the channel if you have any questions then you can ask me in the comment section below or in the telegram group i'll meet you in the next one till then stay safe have fun and bye